Welcome everybody, my name is John with the Cyber Green Support Discord, and today I'm going to be showing you how to add on cars to your 5M server. So, first thing you want to do, you want to open up your browser, and search GTA 5 Mods, and links to all the things that I'm using in the video will be down in the description, such as like WinRAR and OpenIV and all that stuff. So click on this first link right here. And search the vehicle you want to put in. Say you want to put it in an Audi A8. Take the first car you see that you like. I like this one right here, so I'm going to choose this one. I'm going to go ahead and click download. Click download again. Wait for this to download. It might take a minute. Alright, and after you're done, you want to go ahead and click on this. It might take a minute. Go ahead and close this out, and you can close your browser. So next thing you want to do, click on this folder, whatever folder. Click on that, and you want to go ahead on your desktop or wherever, make a new folder, and name it. And go ahead and name it whatever you'd like. I'm going to name it A8. Wait, A8 W12. That's done. So go ahead and open your folder, the new one you just made. Create a new folder in that folder called Stream. And then take the resource.lua, there's a link to download it in the description. Paste that in there. And then open your OpenIV, which you downloaded, which you have in the description. You must have Grand Theft Auto 5 downloaded on your computer to use it. And then click Windows. You wait for this to open. Alright, once, that, once that's finished, you want to go ahead and open this folder again. The open bar. Click and drag this DLC.RPF on this taskbar right here on the left. Wait for it to load. And then come back over here. <clears throat> you can close out your WinRAR. Open data. And then it might be different for some things. It might see a common data. So click on your common and then your data. And click and, click and drag all these aside from vehicle layouts.meta into your folder just right here. And then go back, hit x64, vehicles.rpf, and go ahead and click and drag these into your stream folder. All right, after that's done, oops, sorry. After that's done, you can close out of that, close out of this, and open your folder, <coughs> or sorry, your um, f server. Hold on, I don't wanna, I gotta figure out where it's at. All right, once you're in your server, go ahead and put on resources, and dr click and drag your folder into the resource folder. You wanna rename it and copy the name of it. Go back into your FX server. It's called that for me, because it was a backup. Right click your server CFG, uh, edit with notepad plus plus, N link to this will also be in the description, <clears throat> hit enter, start, space, and then the f file name, or the folder name of the resource you just put in, so in my case it was A8W12, make sure it has the same capitalization, and then you want to hit the save button, and there you go, there you go, your car is ready, if you follow both tutorials correctly, the one with the server how to make the server and this one correctly you should now have a server a working server with add-on cars to it i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did please like share subscribe and have a good day